select the CVT tab from DRA Studio software. Ensure whether the encoder wiring is completed and it is working properly by following below steps. Click Info. Switch on the conveyor to move forward. Check whether the value and pulse updates with the conveyor movement. Add three points on point table and start teaching TF. Move RZ. Then jog the robot and align the tool center point to the center of the fixture. Click Teach. Finish the first teaching. Move RZ. Then jog the robot and align the tool center point to the center of the fixture. Click Teach. Finish the second teaching. Move RZ. Then jog the robot and align the tool center point to the center of the fixture. Click Teach. Finish the third teaching. Save data. Select the Tool Frame tab and click Determine to start teaching the tool size. Move to the first point. Teach first field. Move to the second point. Teach second field. Move to the third point. Teach third field. Select the three fields, click Calculate and Set. The error is recommended to be below 1. If the error value is too big, please retry the above process. Save data. Click Get to confirm the value. Change TF to 1. Jog the RZ align the center of the fixture to see if it can rotate along it. The above steps are the TF setting process. Place the fixture in a position within robot reach on the conveyor, where user want to configure the start point of tracking. For instance starting line is shown. Jog the robot and align the tool center point to the center of the fixture. Before teaching double check whether the right TF, tool frame number is selected on the UI. On the user interface click calibration point 1 to define this point as the starting line. Click next to proceed further. Start the conveyor to move the fixture forward and stop the conveyor at the desired location to teach the stop line. For instance stop line is shown. Jog the robot and align the tool center point to the center of the fixture. Before teaching double check whether the right TF number is selected on the UI. On the user interface click calibration point 2 to define this point as the stop line. Choose the CVT modes as per the application requirement. Vision tracking mode. The mode works with vision system, user has the option to either choose sensor trigger or robot internal trigger. Sensor tracking mode. The mode works with sensor input without vision system. Pitch tracking mode. This mode helps to configure fixed distance tracking does not really need either vision or sensor in particular. In vision tracking mode user needs to measure the camera's field of view using a scale or measuring tape. Feed in the vertical dimension as per actuals. Feed in the horizontal dimension as per actuals. User to configure additional parameter. Trigger source configuration. Sensor mode. In this mode the vision and robot will be triggered upon receipt of the sensor input. Controller DO, period mode. In this mode based on the preset time the robot controller will trigger the vision system consistently to grab the image. Pitch mode. In this mode the robot controller will trigger vision output with the preset fixed pitch to grab the image with preset pitch distance. This illustration is for pitch trigger to grab the image in preset time. Please pay attention that trigger period shall be greater than detection time, else system will be end up with an fault. Configuration of the communication settings in vision system. On the vision system browse to Ethernet tab. Feed in the robot IP and port number. 
User to set the communication start address as 121C, complete the flag as 125A. User shall self-test whether the communication is successful. For example enter the value 15 at address 121C in the command test box. User to check at robot controller address 121C whether the communication is successful. The vision system sends as hexadecimal and the robot receives as decimal. Hexadecimal 15 will be converted to decimal 21 at robot end. Moving forward will be the calibration between the robot and vision system. User to place the calibration template in center of the camera's field of view. Set template center on the vision system. Choose the template pattern. Choose match condition settings and enable rotation center. User to choose the position to define the center of the template. Enter the template center position into the template sent parameters. Use the mark function to record the four point position on the calibration template. User to note the four point position coordinates on the calibration template. Feed in the corresponding pixel coordinate on the CVT user interface vision data mark 1, 2, 3 and 4. After entering click record camera position button. User to choose the vision data conversion unit based on the format of vision system. For immediate reference DMV 1000 with 0.01 .01 pixel and for DMV 2000 with 0.001 pixel. After confirmation, turn the conveyor on to move the calibration template to stop in between start line and stop line. Jog the robot to the mark 1, 2, 3 and 4 corresponding to vision teach points and enter the coordinates in the CVT user interface robot position to carry out 4-point calibration. Post completion, click Calculate Sent. The system will automatically calculate the robot template center POSEX and POSI based on the four point calibration method. Accuracy is based on the vision and robot teaching carried out by the user. User shall slightly move the robot up and press Go continuously until the motion is completed. If the calibration is correct, the robot will move to the center of the template. Click right to update the user frame origin on the robot. Double check whether the coordinate value of position changes to zero with the respective user frame, which indicates success. Further user can add new work points as per the application demand. Jog the robot to the required teach point and click add point. Post that user shall change user frame to zero. Move robot to the standby position to set the standby point. User shall enter the project name and click Create. User shall save the project in the DRA Studio under Solutions. And later update the project list on DRA Studio Project tab. Upon openings the project the point table will be similar to the work points created in the user interface. The current project is ready to automatically track the template. Then we set up business card case. Open the vision system and create a pattern of the business card case. Set the ROI. Sets the shape of pattern. Customize the sample rotation center. After that, rewrite the program. Edit movement paths and control nozzle function. Practical application of CVT. Place five business card cases at different angles. Take images through DMV 3000 and send coordinates value to the robot.
The robot tracks to pick and place it to the specified position. The above content is the teaching of CVT Vision Tracking Mode.